Dallas Mavericks, their owner Mark Cuban, their coach Avery Johnson, and this extraordinary team that had a spectacular run that gave us heart-stopping action all season long. To the Miami Heat, may I say congratulations. You have been an extraordinary story, and we, on behalf of millions and tens of millions of basketball fans around the world, say to you, congratulations, Miami Heat, 2006 NBA champions. Mickey, when Pat Riley took over this team back in December, what went through your mind? I just, I, I just thought from the very beginning we had a good chance, that we had a chance and that if we had the opportunity, we'd get it done. Thanks to 15 strong, these 15 guys, thanks to the hundreds of people in the front office who worked their ass off day in and day out. And thanks to the thousands of them at American Airlines Arena right now, by white hot fans. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations, Mickey. Let me bring in Coach Riley. Wiles, let me ask you what I asked the owner when you took over this team back in December. What did you think going back to coaching? Well, it seems like about five years ago, the only thing I want to say is I want to congratulate Dallas. They had an incredible season. They have an absolutely incredible young coach and a great future. But it was our time. I really believe that it was our time. We have been talking about it all year. We got 15 strong. That's what's in the pit. It looks like a championship trophy. All about 15 strong. That's all I have to say. A great group of guys. Miami, we'll see you in a couple hours. You enjoy. Thank you, everybody. But when you took over, the, did you have doubts at all about going back to coach this team? I, I'm a true believer. I, I have no doubts. I have no fears. The only thing I think about is what it's going to take to win. And these guys showed up and they played all year long. So we came together and, and I want to thank everybody. But that's, it's all about these men and their wives and these families. And everything we put into that big gold pit that we have in the middle of that locker room, folks. Thank you very much. All right, Riles. Thank you. Congratulations, Coach. Here to present the MVP award, let's bring back to the commissioner. He averaged 34.7 points, the third highest scoring average for a player in his first NBA Finals. He averaged 7.8 rebounds and 3.8 assists. He was very much the heart of an extraordinary team, and I do mean team. Congratulations, 2006 MVP, Dwayne Wade. Congratulations. What's going through your mind? Uh, <laughs> I mean, first of all, I just want to thank God for giving us the strength, the courage, the tenacity to fight through all the doubters all year and come out on top. So I just want to give God all the praise for this. Are you surprised at all how Dallas tried to defend you in this series? No, not at all, man. I, I just seen all the defenses. My coaches do a great job of getting me prepared. My teammates do a great job of spacing the court and making shots so I can do what I do. And um, this is a team award, just like this is a team championship. People can tell you what that championship ring is like. Coach Riley can tell you. Shaq can tell you. Now you have that feeling. What is that feeling like? Man, it's one of the best feelings next to my wife and my son. It's one of the best feelings I ever had in my life. So I'm going to live it up because we deserve it. Congratulations. Shaq, come on in. How's this one feel differently than the ones in L.A.? It feels good. I came to Miami because of this young fella right here. I knew he was a special player. I knew the first time I saw him, I knew that he was something special. So I knew it was my job to come here and make him better. When you looked at his skill, when's the first time you said, I, got, I can be Robin to his Batman? 
No, I knew that, you know, he was a young gunner, so when I came there, I decided to let him go, and I was going to be, you know, second option, and I was good with that. And, you know, he's a great player, unselfish player. He's the best in the world, D-Wade. You wanted to play for Pat Riley. You got a chance. What has he meant to your career? Pat Riley is the best coach I've ever had. Uh, him, Dale Brown, you know, my father, you know, they've been, you know, you know telling me to, you know, just stay positive all year. And Coach, uh, coach Riley told us on June 8th that we was going to win on June 20th. Are you sleeping with that thing tonight? No, I'm going to give it to D-Wade, and I'm going to give it to uh, Mr. Arison right here. Congratulations, your fourth title, Shaq. Congratulations to the Miami Heat. Let's go back to you, Mike. Dan, thank you. As Dwayne Wade getting the kudos, showing his brilliance on the NBA's biggest stage. The celebration has begun for the Miami Heat. They win their first NBA championship. Do it in six games. We'll be back to Dallas after this timeout.